Welcome to Web Handling. My name is Dave Roysom. In this video, we discuss the nonsense of roller critical speed. Critical speed is defined as the lowest resonant speed of a roller. So far, so good. Given both an infinitely stiff frame and an infinitely stiff foundation. Obviously, infinitely just about anything, and especially stiff frames and stiff foundations, is nonsense. Unfortunately, it is nonsense that has been touted by top roller suppliers and machine builders alike. You can even find the nonsense in the venerable machine design magazine and other engineering writings. Sure, resonance can be rough. However, the realities are that the frameworks are not infinitely stiff. The realities are that foundations are not infinitely stiff. Worse yet, and quite shameful for engineering, is that the calculations are not conservative. What this means is that the roughness of resonance occurs at a lower speed and well before what you calculate. What this means is that you pay more when you have to upsize by that criteria. What this means is that you get less when the roller system goes into resonance anyway. The realities of system resonances are complicated, even for the simplest of systems such as a roller mounted on a stand with an infinitely stiff foundation as shown here. What the equation might get close to predicting is mode 2, not mode 1 which will hit you first and hit you hardest. Getting deeper into this subject is beyond the scope of these videos. However, I will offer two generalizations related to higher speed machines. First, resonance is often inevitable. Second, you can often survive resonance without practical problems provided that the frameworks are stiff and the rollers are super balanced such as G2.5 or even better. Thank you so very much for watching this module in my plant practical series. Please stay tuned for more roller web handling and web converting topics on this channel. If you want to know more about roller and frame design, please consider my Mechanics of Rollers book.